My name is Shannon Noonan and I'm the Special Projects Officer for Student Mental Health Engagement and Pet Therapy on campus. And it's uh, really kind of a two-part um, position where I am working on engaging students in the conversation around mental health in various ways and also um, piloting a new expansion program for staff and faculty to get involved um, using their own family dogs as therapy dogs on campus. I work really closely with the Enriched Support Program at the Centre for Initiatives in Education and we do office hours there for students in that program. And then we also do some strategic visits with uh, various service centres on campus, so um, CSAS or awards or um, the Career Centre, places that students may not ordinarily um, frequent. We want to try and drive some more traffic in there, also to address maybe some more stressful times of the year. In order to become a therapy dog, um, I would classify the process as kind of having three T elements, so training and temperament and testing. Um, so training would be a base level of obedience skills and temperament is really a natural thing that a dog would um, be very calm naturally and they aren't too excitable, that they want to meet people, they have the inclination to meet other people and get excited about that. and the testing is just there are certain things that they have to pass. The process is a course of six weeks of dog training at a professional dog training school and um, then an evaluation, two evaluations actually to make sure that we're kind of cross-checking um, the different dogs and then if all goes well then they can be part of the program on campus. Blue is pretty much the same at home as he is on campus, but he uh, he's certainly different during active visit time. Um, he knows that people are coming in to see him and that he, he greets every person and there's things that, there's cues that I give him like, go say hi and things like that, that he knows that he is supposed to be um, engaging with other people. Then when we get back to our desk and um, it's kind of the run of the mill and I'm doing work, he's mostly sleeping getting some side treats from people in the office. <laughs> Blue's most off the clock time is when he's playing in the park with other dogs. He loves to run and he likes to wrestle and you would might think he's a different dog than he is at, at work at Carlton. Okay, well, we're coming. Good boy! The, my favorite part of my job is um, the looks that I get when I walk down the hall um, when I'm with Blue on campus and um, there's a noticeable difference on days that I bring him to campus and days that I don't. People don't really recognize me without him um, but also when they do when I do have him the smiles on people's faces strangers walking down the hall they just see him and they just light up with a huge smile. Um, that's probably my favorite part and also just the camaraderie and community that it builds for people around me in my office and students and everyone really. Thank you.